Granada, Livermore, Shea, Hill. The 2019 California 2019 California State Division II Boys Championship Race. We are here with our 2019 Division III state champion, Colton Swinneth of Maria Carrillo High School. First and foremost, Colton, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, a phenomenal accomplishment here today. If you could, just take us through your race. What did you have to accomplish in order to become a state champion? Uh, I knew I had to go out controlled. Um, definitely did not want to lead through the mile, um, nor the two mile. I just really wanted to reel it in the last 1K. Um, we went out, I think I was seventh through the first mile and about a 440 low, uh, probably 443. And felt really smooth, really loved the execution, really just wanted to get ahead of the pack. In previous years, we've been, we've been swept to the back. And this year, I knew I was one of the top guys in the country, it was the state. So I really wanted to just get out there, um, lead my group. And so I went out right next to my teammate Rory and uh, went through the first mile, felt smooth, and then just started picking off guys through the second mile, um, through that, uh, through the, I guess, killer hill, everyone says. Uh, that was, I came through second, felt really smooth, and I knew, I, I knew it was in my, in my, uh, in my corner then. It uh, felt really smooth. Came in, come through that, uh, the actual one mile, um, not the, I guess, two miles here, but one, one mile left, I guess. Uh, felt really smooth and just kind of took it, kept looking back. I got to the Christmas trees, kind of looking back, thinking, is this really happening? Is this really happening? Um, but I guess our taper was amazing. Felt so smooth. Um, came across the line. Yeah. For some reason, there are certain days I just feel effortless, and this is one of those days. I just didn't feel it at all today. I felt so smooth. Now, you talked about feeling smooth and maintaining your plan and not maybe going out a little too hard. Yeah, yeah. When you get in a race like this and there is that pressure, I mean, it's a state championship. Yeah. How were you able to control it and kind of stick to it? Your adrenaline says, man, I got to catch up. I got to do these things. Yeah, yeah. But it's all a part of the plan. How were you able to kind of push that aside and stick with what your formula was coming into this? I just knew that I've seen it in every year out here. I'll watch the races. I watched all the D5 up through D1, um, all the races. The guys that go out first just they end up dying. So I knew, you know what? Go out controlled, feel smooth, don't do it to yourself. You'll regret it later. Um, trust the training. I I am I kind of pride myself on my speed. I'm a 1600 runner in track, so um, I, I love that. So I just knew that I would have it towards the end. So I just a matter of working up through the first mile. Um, coach was telling us just feel smooth. Um, get through the first mile, and then once you hit the first mile, uh, do something symbolic just to break it off and know that's where the race starts. Um, for me, I just started shaking my arms out, started getting going, started um, bringing the heel to the butt a little bit more, kind of got it going, I felt great. Talk about what it's like coming through that finish line knowing that you're gonna be a state champion. When you start your season, that's the goal, that's what everybody works for. Not everybody can experience that feeling. When you stepped across that finish line and realized that there was nobody in front of you or on the side of you, what was that moment like for you? I, I really was a loss for words. I felt so amazing, I felt so blessed, so fortunate. Um, all the training coming together the whole year uh, to come across that line and then to turn around after that, give myself a little bit of breath and say, oh my God, there's Rory, my teammate. To see, I just hear Rory, Rory, Rory. And so I just started screaming. I, I started honestly crying, I was bawling. I, I had, we've been training together for four years. So to see Carrillo go one, two, it was amazing. Well, an amazing effort here today again. Maria, Maria Carrillo Sr., Colton Swinneth, our state champion for Division Three, 15-11 here today. Teammate goes number two. Congratulations, Colton. Thank Excellent you. Job.